Rock Boss here in Estero, Florida today, uh, inspecting a concrete tile roof for Miss Marsh. I'm starting from the ladder because um, as soon as I got up here, you could see right away there's been some repairs done. And they were done with the wrong tile. Um, the existing tile here is a discontinued Monier tile. So someone tried to use a tile that had a very similar color, but different locking system and different size. As you can see, they tried to trim down both sides. So, to give you a little better view of that, you can see how this was cut, as well as here. And as you can see, they certainly don't match up very well. So, found some of those throughout the roof. There's three right here. All these marks you see are just chalk. They'll, they'll come right off in the next rain. Um, this roof has also had some previous repairs done. You can see several cracks here that have been caulked in the past. So that's several of these corner breaks. Those are certainly less significant than some of the other issues we're finding. Um, here again is another tile that was replaced. I'd say within the last uh, two, three years, probably just after Irma. And again, you can see it's the improper lock and improper size. They've actually completely cut the lock off on this side. So, um, here's another one where they were able to get the probably the same tile, same profile, but not the right color, so they attempted to paint it. Some more cracks. Um, here's another previous repair where it had been cracked all the way vertically as well as here. That one actually leads right to where the fastener is and it's been caulked. Here's actually a couple of uh, repairs that I missed. And those are all again where they use the, the wrong tile to do a repair. So it's pretty likely that some of this may have been previous but I'm sure these were done after Irma Unfortunately, the previous homeowner should have filed the claim and this whole roof would have been replaced. Just more cracks. All right, let's get moving along. So, step into the front now. It's another one that was in, repaired with the incorrect tile. Crack leading to the fastener. Now, of course, I didn't mark every single crack or chip up here because there are several but you can see some more down there all right stepping over to dr julie's side now and there's a couple of other things i can show you over here so anywhere that i mark these tiles with an l that's a spot that i found that was very loose and you're probably going to hear some of these moving as i'm walking on the video but if we look here we can see not only are they loose but they're coming out of position and this gives you a good example as to why. Each of these tiles is fastened with one nail. Uh, it's a fairly inferior and obsolete system. But what happens is when these tiles chatter up and down in the wind, they pull those nails up and then over time they get bent and start coming down. And you can see when I lift this tile, it lifts that whole area. So there's several areas like that. I only marked a couple of them. But as you can see here, this is definitely a potential for a leak in the future. All right, let's uh, continue on showing you some more of the repairs. Again, you can see where the tile is just way out of whack. Um, there was some type of repairs done up here at some point. You can see this piece obviously doesn't belong. Um, you can see here where Looks like somebody tried to replace the upper tile here, but they cut it too short, so they left a nice open screw and a cracked tile here. Again, definitely a potential leak, as are these. Um, the underlayment is what truly protects the roof, but there's good roofing practice to try and keep the water from ever touching the underlayment to begin with. I'm not going to go all the way down to the edge, but here again you can see mismatched tile there. Step into the back side now. So back here, main issue is a lot of loose tile. You can see where I've marked some of them. Try and get it at a good angle here, but if you look at it um, straight on, you can actually see 
how the tiles have been moved out of position. When you install these tiles, they want to lay in the proper position. But you can see how these are.